All right, so let's talk about Team Rumble. So with the last update, they updated Team Rumble again. And unfortunately, from what I've read online and on social media, it was not another pleasant update for it. So at the start of Season 7, they did something that pretty much everyone who was a normal Team Rumble player hated. They had both bus routes going the exact same way, and they made the storm start closing in immediately. So for anyone that wanted to do Team Rumble for challenges or to loot around, they basically eliminated that and forced everyone into the first circle right away. Then a little later on, they updated it so the bus routes didn't go the same direction, but they left everything else the same. And with this most recent update, they changed it again. So I have not played Team Rumble since that update. I just heard all about it on social media. So let's take a look and see what they did. So I also put Phil on just in case I get recognized or someone wants to chat with me. So that'll be cool. Got three random teammates. So this looks the same right now. Actually, the bus routes are going the same way again. Hmm. Okay, so this is what I was talking about. This is all pretty much normal. So I haven't noticed any changes yet, so we'll just loot up a second. But this is what I was talking about. If you haven't played Team Rumble yet, they made the first circle, and then it's going to start closing in almost immediately. We've got about five seconds. So you can see it's already moving after literally 10 seconds being on the map. But what happens after this circle? That's what I want to find out. So we'll just loot up real quick, and we'll see. Let's see if anyone has a mic. Anyone got a mic? Ding dong with a mic. Holy faint mic, that man. I can't even hear you. Sorry, I was mumbling. I was saying I got a ding dong with a mic, but we're in Team Rumble, so. <laughs> okay, well, I just wanted to ask you your opinion on something. Uh, so, they made some changes to this, right? To Team Rumble? Yeah, I hate them. You hate them? I kind of, I, I don't like them. I find, well, I like doing team challenges in Team Rumble, and I just find that basically they make, like, look, right now I'm in the storm doing a challenge, and oh, yeah. it was in a storm from the get-go. And so oh. they're making it harder to do challenges in, in Team Rumble, which encourages people to do challenges in-game, which is really frustrating when you're playing a real game and some idiot goes off doing a challenge. <laughs> okay, I, I can relate to that. That's nice. But... So that, that's how Team Rumble has been this entire season, but I heard that they started doing moving circles now. Is that right? Yeah, but no, they've, they've been switching around back and forth. Like Team Rumble, at one point, the buses were going opposite. They started off going the same direction, and the circle was really small, and it was static sort of thing. And then they started that the they were going in different directions, and then now they back went back to the same direction, and basically the circle, the storm's moving around. Okay. And do you like that the storm's moving or the circle i guess you know i my guess is what it probably does is that it's for the people that don't like building or build battles because it definitely makes it there's never a build scene right because they've made it move around so much you can't have a build battle going on somewhere where like the whole map is now covered with builds oh, yeah. so for that it's good i guess if you don't like builds and i'm not crazy about dealing with people that do excessive buildings but uh, aside from that Okay. Uh, I find you're running around a lot. Yeah. Okay. I was just curious. Thank you. Thank you for the insight. I appreciate it. No worries. All right. So that guy was super nice. So as you can see, the second circle has definitely moved, which means the whole map is going to have to shift to the left over here. That's uh, interesting to say the least. But according to his wee ding dong, <laughs> uh, he is not really a fan of that. So that's really what I wanted to hear. Uh, so I'm recording a video for YouTube. I was just, uh, this is my first time playing Team Rumble in a while. So I was just seeing, trying to interview some peeps and see what they say. <laughs> no worries. Oh, he was actually not on our team. <laughs> He sniped and completely missed me, but I was sure it was just someone kind of scared me. <laughs> so I think they did this to, well, like that guy was saying, to eliminate those massive build battles that were kind of just in the center of the map. 
I mean, we'd get that one circle and then everyone would just flock there and then there'd just be non-stop build battles, but isn't that the point? I just, I don't understand why they put moving circles now. I mean, why would they want to eliminate that? Okay, so the next circle is a little bit smaller, obviously, and up here. So at least you get to move around the map a little bit more this time. Because, like I said before, we were stuck over here on the first circle. Boom, newbie. Look at this guy. Bop, 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 bop. Here I come as a cow to get you. Three, two, one, and pop. Yeah, triple kill with the cow. Rolling with my homies. Oh, taper time. I recognize you. Now he recognizes me. I did not realize I was actually talking to a real YouTuber. Ah. Oh, yeah. I, was one of those, oh, yeah. I thought it was one of those guys that say they're, they're YouTubers and aren't. Oh. Hey, I didn't say I was a YouTuber. But I well, let me know uh, <laughs> when I can see it up there. I'll show my son. Oh, how old is he? He's 13. Ah, oh, let's, go. let's no, go. He doesn't watch. He doesn't play much of uh, this anymore. Uh, okay. Yeah. Uh. Well, I gotta take my son to a baseball game, but then I'll. It, it'll be uploaded today, though, for sure. Cool. I'll let him know. That's awesome. Oh, that is super cool. Shout out to his son. 13 years old. What's his name, by the way? Uh, I'm calling him Gray Rowdy Rain or Vic. What? <laughs> wait, wait a minute. <laughs> Gray Rowdy Rain is the is, is, is player name in Fortnite, but his real name is Vic. Or Vic. Victor. Okay. I'll, I'll give him a little shout out. Cool. I frequently hear people say that they're YouTubers, but it's like watching them play, I always question it. <laughs> But yours, I know the name, I've seen the name a couple of times, and I'm looking for how to do challenges and stuff. Well, I appreciate it. Thanks for helping me no out problem. with my little interview earlier. No problem. Have yourself a great one. All right. Thanks very much. You too. So there you go. That's all there is to it. Shout out to that guy's son, Victor, for recognizing me. Obviously, the dad recognized me, but he said he has a 13-year-old son named Victor. So, Victor, I know you don't watch YouTube, but... I'm giving you a shout out. Thanks very much for having an awesome dad that plays Fortnite. Now, as for the changes in Team Rumble, uh, I don't know. I've been seeing people say they ruined it again, so that's probably going to be the title of this video. They ruined Team Rumble, dot, 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 again, exclamation mark. Let me know in the comments what you think about the changes to Team Rumble, though. Do you like the moving circles or do you not? I'm sure most people would want everything to revert back how Team Rumble was before Season 7. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaperTime.